Hi, I'm Johanna Bonds with the Central Regional Tourism District, where every town has a story. Today, we're in Glastonbury, Connecticut at Sayalita. Come enjoy some amazing Mexican cuisine. Let's hear their story. Hi, my name is Bill Driggs and I own Sayulita, a Mexican restaurant here in South Glastonbury, Connecticut. Through travels in, in Mexico and throughout the world, got the idea of doing this restaurant, Sayulita. The name comes from this cool little town on the Pacific coast of Mexico where I like to go and surf and relax and they have great food and kind of was the inspiration behind the restaurant. And we kind of brought that inspiration here to South Glastonbury and tried to offer the area something a little bit different, something that they hadn't seen before in terms of Mexican cuisine. I think our signature dishes are our tacos. I mean, they're a la carte tacos. They come in a wide variety and we often do specials and they range lobster and black truffle taco. We also have things like al pastor and some fish tacos and shrimp and things that are very authentic Mexican type cuisine. So I think the tacos and, and tamales as well are two of our favorites. Our drink menu here is, I mean, obviously it's about margaritas and we use fresh ingredients for our margaritas, you know, fresh squeezed lime juice, which is I think the key to a really good margarita, and it's one of the keys, and along with good tequila and some agave, and it's very simple. But we also use fresh local ingredients. You know, in the summer, it's great. We have access to blueberries and raspberries and peaches, and we use all those to make special margaritas. All of the guys working behind the bar here are very experienced, and they like to bring new ideas. And right now, during COVID, we are able to sell drinks. If they buy food, they can also grab a drink with a lid on it to go. So that's been very popular, so people still have access to our margaritas. COVID-19 obviously hit the restaurant industry very hard and it really changed how we had to go about business. We're a small restaurant. We had to quickly change over to doing to-go food only. So we changed our whole way of doing business with to-go containers and the efficiencies in the kitchen and trying to find the food that traveled the best to put on a limited menu that we could sell. And we kind of transitioned into a strictly to-go format. We're fortunate. It's worked pretty good. I think in this time, people have been looking for more casual fare and we do have a lot of new customers and guests because they are able to do takeout. Unfortunately, we're probably going to have to go back to either all indoor dining and very limited takeout. When I say that, we're thinking about maybe doing, you know, every day from like two to three, we'll take 20 calls for, for some to-go food. And that's really all we'll be able to handle. We can't, our kitchen, when the restaurant's full and jamming, the kitchen can't handle doing to-go food. We just don't have the space and the capacity to do it. I think Connecticut is a great place to come and visit and try different kinds of cuisine, good restaurants. With somebody that's lived here my whole life, it's just a great place to come back to. Look forward to seeing you at Sayulita sometime soon. Stop by and say hi and have a classic margarita. For additional Mexican restaurants, check out our Taco Trail brochure at ctvisit.com.